Hi there, I'm Tanya Rush, host of Big Sky Blend. Thanks for joining us. Today we are spreading good news. First Federal Bank and Trust is off to a running start, honoring those who are making a difference in our community. Today's focus, American Foundation for Suicide Prevention, Montana Chapter, also known as AFSP. Robin Barta joins us with First Federal Bank and Trust. Welcome back. And from AFSP, we have Nancy Barbula and Aaron Bratsky. Congratulations. Thank you so much. First, a little bit of background, your community commitment. What is this? Yes, yeah, so the program this year um, is we are just living by our mission statement, which is to support and improve the lives of our staff, our customers, and our communities. So we are doing $1,000 a week to a nonprofit here in Yellowstone County, just our way of supporting all the wonderful work they do in our communities. Doesn't that just make you feel good? Yes, That's we love it. That's what I'm saying, it's good news. You have, you pick four a month. Correct, it's Share every week. Every week, mm -hmm. you're busy. <laughs> it is, it's busy, but it's fun. Share some other groups. Yeah, so some other organizations that have won are um, the Native American Development Council, um, the Billings Education Foundation, on um, Rocky Mountain College, and of course the AFSB. Big guest here today, once again, yes. congratulations. Thank you so much, Tanya. Nancy, $1,000, how are we gonna use that? You oh, have a gosh. big walk coming up. <laughs> we do, we're just thrilled to be one of your recipients. Thank so you so excited. much, Thank Robin. Um, the $1,000 will go to our local chapter, which will then go to our annual goal. And the money then will be used for um, valuable resources back into the community be, to be used for suicide prevention efforts. And Erin, share more details about the walk. You put a lot of work and effort and love into this. We do. You do. We do. It, what's, what's important to know is that suicide is the 12th leading cause of death mm -hmm. in the U.S. And unfortunately, Montana always ranks one of the highest per capita mm -hmm. of death by suicide. So it's really an important cause for our community. And so this walk brings us together in a way that is uh, profound for people who are healing. So it's it's a wonderful event and we're so glad to put it on. AFSP brings resources back to our community and education for survivor mm -hmm. loss, for advocacy, all of those things. How can people get involved? You're starting now. We are. Our planning team is now meeting and we're always looking for committed individuals to join our team. And we can, um, you can be sponsors, register a team and walk or as an individual and we are always looking for volunteers to help us throughout the year and at our walk event. First one, September? Yes, it's September. September, mm -hmm. all right. Erin, the event is not only for loss survivors mm -hmm. or those with lived experiences. It's right? not only not for only. those, it really is for everyone. So the walk is really healing mm -hmm. for people who have been impacted by suicide, but we also know the community ripple mm -hmm. effect of suicide and that's why we wanna bring everyone together. So it's a place of healing and hope. Um, I walk for someone that I have lost mm -hmm. as well. And so the compassion in a group of people is mm -hmm. profound. We also yes. have amazing activities, music, um, silent auction, all of those things. Visit AFSP.org slash Yellowstone Valley to register for the Out of the Darkness Walk, or better yet, for all the details, scan the QR code right there on your screen. The First Federal Bank and Trust team are looking forward to another four nonprofit recipients. For details, the best way, scan the QR code. For banking needs, visit efirstfederal.bank. They paid for today's segment.